my god, bruh. Warning, we have Unk Shark inbound. Unk Shark inbound. If I see one comment of you guys calling me Unk or Auntie, I'm gonna be pissed. This is the world's oldest shark. We got a boomer. <laughs> but how old actually is it? This Wait, I think I've seen this one. It's like 400 years old, that thing. The ancient, deluxe ancient, ancient Unk Shark. This absolute fossil over here is the Greenland shark. And this may come as a shock to you, but the Greenland shark is found in f***ing Greenland, man. What? I forgot that. I was, was looking for people to be like, the Greenland shark is from the East, East China Sea. East China Sea. I can't speak. And with Grandpa Shark here coming in at a f***ing kaiju size, six meters in length, and a literal... Look, at, he looks old, bro. Look at him. Whoa. Wait, there's no way. Is this fake? Fucking ton in weight. This senior citizen probably worked with Godzilla back in his fucking day. But how senior is senior? Well, you might be expecting him to say something along the lines of, you know, 100 years, maybe 150 years, right? You know, try higher. No, not 200. Mm, close, but not 300 either. Chocolate. No, the Greenland shark can live up to... Five hundred fucking years. Hundred years. You know, I don't think you understand how old that is. So no, I, I know it's five hundred years. To put it in perspective, this is Bob. Bob has just turned five hundred. <laughs> Here is a list oh. of things this has lived through. All eight of King Henry's divorces. The invention of chocolate. <laughs> I remember when they first invented chocolate. Shakespeare's entire lifespan. The Boston Tea Party. The signing of the Declaration of Independence and the founding of the United States. That was the USA. God was the great USA. The colonization of Australia. The industrial f***ing revolution. The invention of the light bulb the and the adoption of electricity. <laughs> the Titanic becoming a submarine. <laughs> World War One, the Great Depression, World War Two, the Vietnam War, the fucking moon landing, and the invention of the internet. And bro has seen fucking everything. First Question episode mark? of SpongeBob. Sh Wait, what was that? What? <laughs> what was that? Wait, hold up, we gotta go back. We have to go back. Invention of the internet. Is that a shark with some, some like, hanging goddamn milkers? The first episode of SpongeBob. What? Schlatt's crimes in '99. 2001, the invasion of Iraq, the global financial crisis, the death of Harambe, Australia catching... Dude, we, we fucking forgot about Harambe. Dude, everyone forgot about Harambe, man. Fire the virus, and it's still with... <laughs> it's pretty, well, it's like, oh, you know what? Yeah, I'll, I'll declare the virus too from that one, I think. I don't think you understand just how Where's old our... sharks are. We got a Wait, he was like on like a shark week. Multiple shark videos in one week? Hold up. Boomer. See, I'm not just talking individual sharks. Hammerheads, Bruce from Nemo, Jet. Oh, he means those species. No, no, I know this one. The, the, the shark as a species is like older than humanity. It's ancient. If yeah. Your average shark lives anywhere between 20 to 80 years. Nothing all that special. I'm talking sharks as a species. Because as a concept, sharks are fucking <laughs> one tricks. They have made this class through every single balance adjustment Earth has thrown at them. From climate change, to the ice age, to that time God decided to punt a rock at Barney the Dinosaur. <laughs> yeah, when it comes to prehistoric oh shark species, God. most people think he's Megalodon. Edits, his, edits are, like, he's, he just, his edits are just too crazy, man. Too crazy edits. Is this Megalodon? That big boy the size of a kaiju that was swimming around in the ocean around 26 million years ago. Which um, might sound like a long time, but uh, as far as sharks go, this thing's a f***ing zoomer. Go back around 200... What? Oh my god, I hate how like zoomers, or, like kids, are tied to smoking e-cigs. Fifty million. Back in my day, the only people who smoked e-cigarettes were like all the grandmas that were trying to quit smoking. And the e-cigarettes, the vapes, the vapes just looked like cigars or cigarettes. Years to the early Triassic, before the literal dinosaurs, and you'll find helicopter. Dinosaurs. A shark with a f buzz saw for a mouth. Two hundred and fifty, not far back enough for you. Go back around three hundred million years, and you will find Adestus, the. F Pog shark. <laughs> and if that now, is still is that? not far back enough, you can go all the way back, right to the beginning, to the first recognizable shark, Doliotus problematicus, at 410 
million years old. Why is it, prob why is it problematic though? Hold on. Sharks have existed for four times longer than Saturn has had rings. The first tree <laughs> only sprouted out of the ground 385 Wait, that million heard it years ago. That I've Deluxe already heard it on the floor. I mean, the, people, people have said sharks are older than trees. I've heard that. I didn't know it was that, though. I didn't know it was that. Jesus. I did not know it was that. It means that for 25 million years, Groot's great-great-grandfather was sat in God's drafts while this f***er chased what Nemo. Why Twitter? Why Twitter? Why am I getting jump scared by Twitter? No. <laughs> Dolidius and the prolatic, the first bruise. Okay, Scientists bro. just discovered a new fish. It's the thing with the human face from the show. <laughs> Looks fing ridiculous. Oh. oh, look how cute that is. Oh, look at that's a that's a ocean pup. An ocean dog. This is the bumpy oh. snailfish. A freshly discovered species found off the coast of California. California what makes this Absolutely. Am I, am I fucked up? It's kind of cute though. It's kind of cute though. Am I fucked up? Oat specimen. Stick out is that it's a deep sea fish found at a depth of three kilometers. And I am here to tell you exactly why. Because once God finished building this thing, he took a step back, looked at it, realized exactly how fucking chopped it was, and Hunted that thing into the depths of the ocean where no one would. It's cute. What? Why is he flaming the shark? Oh, look at it. Is that chopped? That looks kind of cute to me. And punted that thing into the depths of the ocean where no one would ever see it again. Be free. <laughs> However, thanks to the hubris of mankind, it is here before us today to take the piss out of. <laughs> I mean, fucking look at it. It is a profoundly unserious creature. <laughs> I do so not think a single fucking thought fuck? has ever spawned behind those eyes. No. Yeah, and its brain might be smooth. It might have the tail of a tadpole, but it's always cute though. Not to mention the fit on it's it. Cute, though. It looks like an aquatic, uncooked turkey <laughs> with a f***ing smiley face drawn on it. Coming in at a solid three inches in length, Bumpy here is not the only species of snailfish. There's others that look like this. Uh, however, unlike his cousins, God deemed it so that this poor little f would be built like a shaved testicle. <laughs> the scientific term so for a much. pair of these should be a sack. Oh However, despite God. the fact that he looks like a sperm cell with a receding hairline. I won't speak. I won't speak. Because goddamn. Because goddamn. Because goddamn. I love him. He's so yeah. cute. Look at that smile. Oh, this reminds me I of sack it. boy. Dude, I need more parts with a softie in the inside. Aww. On the PS3. I oh, know when they got his ass on camera, he looked at it and went... You know, when you sewed me up, you put some of the stuffing in the wrong places, so I'm, I'm a little f***ed up. But will you take care of me forever and ever? Ooh. This crab is... Yo, the chili the crab! Let's go! Wait, I know this one! The chili the crab, I know this one. It has freaking um, an uh, anemones on its claws. I like, it like uses it to fight off animals and stuff. A boxer. What's your name? Actually, based crab. <laughs> That's right, stepping into the ring at 0 0.15 grams and a huge 2.5 I never realised it, it was the size of a fingernail. What? It is in length. It's the Boxer Crab. You see, while most crabs use their pinches to feed and defend themselves, <laughs> the Boxer Crab... <laughs> what the fuck is wrong with men, man? Why would they do that? <laughs> The boxer crab has instead <laughs> elected to spec into CQC and uh, throw f***ing hands. And despite their completely average and not at all small size, this f***er fights in the heavyweight division. Able to punch out sh Now this guy, this guy dope. This guy cheats. This guy boxes with Alec padding in his gloves. Like, bro's literally carrying your own weapons. Hundreds of times its size. But how does nature's little Mac win the fights? Well, that's pretty simple. He f***ing cheats.
Yeah, yeah, exactly. You see, those little pom poms cheese. aren't a fashion choice. Those are both C and anemones that the box of crab holds in its claws to use as basically f***ing brass knuckles. Now, they get these anemones <laughs> by... Not, not, not just basically, literally. It's literally carrying around the chemical weapons. It's like you leave the bar to like, okay, but I'm fist fight. And the other guy has fucking acid on his hands. Uh, what? Finding other box of crabs who have them, jumping them, and then claiming them like they are a f***ing WWE title belt. <laughs> yeah, if what? you weren't aware, anemones are venomous plant-like animals moments. that, in order not to get eaten, sting the sh** out of anything that touches them. Boxer crabs are immune to that sting, but you bet your ass that everything that tries to eat the boxer crab isn't. So, the crab and the anemone enter into a symbiotic relationship, essentially becoming an aquatic Venom, with the anemone getting some of the crab's food, the and the crab gaining venomous brass knuckles. <laughs> so, whenever a predator gets in the ring with Crab Nano Tyson machines, here, son. he'll wait for it to get just within striking range, and then... Mr. Squidward! I should... This is literally how I look at fucking a cookie, by the way. How I wake up, looking at something I should not eat, and I know I should eat this. Thank you, <laughs> Buddy, buddy, bye.